Hi Pisces! Welcome to my channel. We're doing your ascendant sign, okay? Um, so if you don't know your ascendant, pause the video. Go to the link and then find out first if this is your ascendant. It can or it may be, you know, you can have your, your sun and rising the same, you know, and ascendant all the same. Okay? So check it out first because this might not be it. So go to the other ascendant sign. Alright. This is going to be a general read. And thank you very much for donating to the GoFundMe. Alright? And all those stuff that I keep announcing every day. Alright. So this is going to be, um, we're going to have a discussion later on on why this is important. Okay. We'll have that for later. A general read, basically what just I see, can be anything. Alright, Cancerians? Oh, Cancerians? Okay. Pisces. Because in case of water sign, maybe you're thinking too much of a Cancer. Cancerians. Pisces, this is you, June. Oh, here we go. Oh. From what I'm saying, uh, what they're saying is like, uh, the world is upside down right now. Just a general message, not the tarot. The world is upside down. Pick it as how it is, how you see it. Look at that, the moon card is here too. Full moon when I'm doing this. I mean, on the other side of the world. Okay, what I'm seeing here. Spices, spices, spices. An ending with the fire sign. Death. Knight of Wands. New beginning. You can also have a new fire sign in your life. Hmm. But I'm seeing here two of wands. So there's an energy of contemplating, thinking of the situation um, without taking action. You're holding on to it. Okay, um, but you have here walking away, Eight of Cups, walking away from memories, walking away from emotion, because it's really over here. Death comes because of a new life, which is good. Okay, that's so awesome. You can probably have been praying for this ending already, for this cycle to finish. Okay, but there was something that was, you know, that wasn't clear yet until maybe this full moon or until this time that you're watching it. This is the moon card, so there can be some secrecy, something, um, you know, it wasn't about omission, but you know what, I'm gonna read it for you. Three. Ah, okay, there you go. Um, someone you, that you have cared for, the Empress, okay. Four of Swords, something, someone that you need some healing, and someone that you have put a lot of effort in. That was in, that, that was in the moon card, so that was you also, okay, that's what you have been doing. Let me see just this, uh, um, this death card. Oh, waiting for a new life with a fire sign again? Oh no, you're waiting. Pisces, why are you doing this to yourself? Hangman, this is this is clarifier for this, okay? I don't do clarifier much because I get the message with one card. But for you, I'll do it. Waiting. Fire sign, offering. Stress. You're waiting for the offer and then the offer game and then you got stress. So... You have to decide. Are you in or are you out, Pisces? Are you in or are you out? Three of Cups. Third party. Do you see? Look at that. Three of Cups over here and the Three of Cups over here. You're looking at the situation where there was a third party and then the, the fire sign or someone offered you another cup and you didn't like it. See? Relationship. Four of Wands. Stability that you wanted. Ace of Pentacles, an earth sign. An earth sign being successful, being stable. Can be, you have four and four over here. Eight, a cycle. Can be a Leo also, from what I'm seeing. No, because when I say Leo, don't even ask why I said that, because that's what they want me to say. Okay. So, you really have to think about how you want to move forward because you get what you wish for and then it made you stress. The fire sign came back maybe, but you got stress. It took you a long way to heal, to care for yourself, and then to walk away and then just to think about the person again. There was a third party already. And then when they come back, of course, you, you focus now your energy. It's like, oh, you betrayed me. You weren't honest with me. The person didn't leave you, I don't think so. They just became successful. Very, very successful. Ace of Pentacles. 
the whole world open up for this person. And I don't think this is you. This is an earth sign. That's what I'm saying, Pisces. Let me see how, how you can proceed. Just for you guys. Two of Pentacles, Page of Swords, Five of Pentacles. Not sure you can proceed though. Because you're playing a game of juggling. Imagine in a circus when the person is juggling, you're playing with it. How long can you juggle? Page of Swords over here. How long can you juggle your thoughts? Five of Pentacles. How long before you really understand that you need help, Isis? You need help. Acknowledgement that you need help is the first step so that you can move on. And that's how you can proceed. All right. I know it's tough. The message is tough. It's your ascendant sign. The ascendant has to be addressed. Like what I mentioned, these are the steps that you can proceed with your life. The houses that you need to address. Relationship, you know, finances, studies, school, higher yourself. Those are the houses. That's why this ascendant is ascendant rising is very, very important for you guys to understand. What are you addressing in the first house? What are you addressing in your second house? Okay? So that's all there. So I hope this is a start for everyone to get educated, especially Pisceans who are very, very close to me. Okay? It's a hard lesson. But once you learn, you're going to be a scholar. Okay? So thank you very much, guys. And I hope to see you guys again. Should you need a reading, I'm booked for June. Next day readings are available. Ciao!